today's live show is inspired by my desperate need for currency and a long talk with my mother about how things can be worth money and not be currency like my work. We got down to discussing intellectual property and that's what this is. I own this intellectual property that I am creating and it is valued in a number of ways such as difficulty to reproduce. So I was thinking about the ways I've been trying to create intellectual property as I was taught in my human computer interaction design education as well as the other education I had on how to bring designs to reality and with software oftentimes reproducing the software once you've seen the software isn't nearly as difficult as the first production of the software but in case of today's intellectual property I want to create uh, reproducing this song while it will be easier than having to create the song anew as I will the performance of the song if I can get it to the standard I want it to is extraordinarily difficult it's not something people can get just by getting a master's degree and putting the time in with a mind it takes an abled body as well I'm not sure what I'm calling this one yet so many things going wrong. I was doing pretty good when I wasn't really making the money. I mean, I was trying to make the money, you know, doing the work, rehearsing and stuff, trying to make that money, but I wasn't live performing and publishing, getting my full rights to the money. Now that I'm making that money or trying to make that money, things are going wrong. Guitar is buzzing, it wasn't buzzing before. Uh, it's got me mad. Calm down a little, get back to it. I'd like to turn off the refrigerator, I'm not sure if you can hear it. Uh, but it's not in the best of health, I'm probably going to have to mark it up as a loss if it comes through in the audio lost to my business to this money I'm trying to make because if things go right this will sound like a studio produced piece of music by simply clipping it from the video
wonder if the buzzes came through. <laughs> Not a bad piece. That went pretty well. I liked it. Like listening to it, pretty sure I'll like hearing it again. And I think it compares to the most expensive of work out there. And having done music study of people who perform this type of work, it has become obvious that most of them are not playing these pieces live, unedited, in a row. They're using a bunch of studio techniques to achieve music of that value. Trying to just get a sample of this and a sample of that, just play that riff, just get that transition, not playing whole pieces in a row. Solo. No metronome, nothing. Good luck reproducing that piece I just played. I think it was quality work. I think it's hard to reproduce. I think I made some money.